Having EDS is one thing. <laughs> having it until I drive a manual car is another. Good morning guys, so my feed is priming at the moment, like I said it, like I said yesterday I'm not editing any vlogs at all, possibly tonight, most likely tomorrow though, so but by the time you're watching these guys they will most likely all be up but um yeah I just feel like I should say that even though I probably will mention it on Instagram just because that's just my feed finishing priming. Um, yeah, I'll probably mention it on Instagram just so people know that don't worry, nothing's happened. I'm just not editing because people do worry when I don't vlog since I'm a daily vlogger. Um, so yeah, I'm wearing this top today with my ripped jeans where they got like rips like all the way down. Anyway, yeah, um, I'm so tired. I really like I, this morning I was just like oh, day four I cannot be bothered but we're so close guys tomorrow morning is my theory and hazard test like the proper one assuming that I pass that I'll be taking my test sometime next week it can be Monday it can be any day like they can ring you on that day and be like oh there's a slot this afternoon or whatever so yeah it could be any day next week Hopefully my instructor thinks I'm ready. Obviously she'll let me know tomorrow because tomorrow's our last days in the car um, And obviously tomorrow is a shorter day because we're only going out in the cars um, Because if you've passed your theory test you don't need to stay for the theory because we, we basically get back to the classes between half two and three and then after that um, You have like a brief down and then you do theory practice and stuff like that So after the brief down it'd be about the three o'clock and we finish at three so yeah um, I'm really confident actually on my theory and hazard like when I've been doing the mocks which are harder Than the they make them harder than the actual test So basically if you're passing the mocks with the driving school that I'm with then you'll probably pass the other ones Um with that said I have actually taken the theory test in Australia and passed and Let me just say I studied for that the night before like it that is piss easy this is hard like I've been studying all week and I come home and study like it is hard there's so much more to remember and driving manual makes it even harder as well because you've got so much more to think about um anyway I'm gonna stop babbling but I do wanted to do a bit of a longer intro just because I don't really vlog as much in the day um but anyway let me guys know what you think of my new camera I think this is this will be my proper first proper vlog where I'll be vlogging the whole day with it anyway love you guys so so much let's get on with the day Guys, what a day. So, literally just finished. Um, I am exhausted. Uh, just, I'm in the bathroom. Uh, yeah, I'm so, so tired. But I've been practicing my mock tests and everything and I'm pretty confident. I'm getting above 90% every time. Um, I'm fine with my hazard perception. I thought I'd struggle with that, but I'm actually okay with that. I'm better with that. Um, so I'm just about to use the, <laughs> use the bathroom. Um, but my granddad's on his way because Tom's working um, at a high school this evening. Like he's working in the evening. So he can't pick me up. But yeah, basically that's what's happening. I'm going to go home and sleep because I'm feeling a lot more tired than I did than I have done. Like I felt okay. Like, can you not? Thank you. Uh, yeah, I'm feeling a lot more exhausted than I have done, than I did yesterday, so I'm gonna go home and sleep for a bit and I'm gonna do a couple more theory tests just before I go to bed and then I'll do one in the morning before I go um, to Manchester because my test time's at 8 a.m. but we have to be there 15 minutes early, so it's actually 7.45 and it's gonna take ages to get into Manchester, um, so I'm gonna have to get up at like half six. <sighs> But apart from that, you know how I said on the score sheet of how well you're doing, I'm getting scoring mostly twos and threes, and then all, all the threes, which means you do it without even, like without them telling you to. Tomorrow we're doing a mock, like practical test as well in the afternoon, but in the morning we're just gonna try and get all those twos to threes. It's mainly junctions um, that I just need to, and when I'm turning into junctions as well, just need to slow down, gear right down, before I turn because I'm trying to change my gears way too soon but anyway yeah um so 
I'll update you guys later. Never mind getting sideswiped by a car as a bloody hazard. I just got sideswiped by this goddamn tree. Look at this. Right there. Oh, what the hell is this branch doing? Dangerous place to put a tree. So I've come outside. It's half four. Well, actually, it's about quarter to five. And my granddad's not here. And I've walked around and I can't see him. Also, that's one of the main roads behind me that we've been practicing on, hence why it's so loud. Um, yeah, so I'm just waiting for him pretty much. It's really, really cold. Bit nervous about tomorrow now. It's kind of set in the, today, that was like the last time to practice for theory and hazard. But I'm feeling pretty confident and my driving instructor is pretty confident that I'm gonna pass the practical side of it. So, fingers crossed. Yeah, so fingers crossed that everything works out. Oh, I'm so, so tired, guys. I can't explain to you how exhausting this driving course has been that I can't even muster words to explain it to you guys. Like, having EGS is one thing, <laughs> having you enter the driver manual car is another. The problem is my joints, basically. Um, because my joints and ligaments and all that are really unstable, when I, for example, now, if I put my wrist against the wall like this, hold it up over here. If I've got it against the wall like that, now if I was to do a handstand, what would happen is my wrist would start bending. As you can see, it's bending and bending and bending and bending. Now, that's bending way, 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 way past the normal range of motion. Now, can you imagine that on my knees and my ankles? Because that is what's happening when I hit the brakes, when I put the clutch down, which you have to do every time you want to change gear, um, anytime you want to like slow down, anything like that. There's a lot of pushing and stopping, pushing and stopping. And also changing gears, handbrakes. So all of these mo mo motions with my ankles, with my knees, with my wrists, with my fingers, with the, with the indicators and stuff like that. That's all putting a lot of strain on them and basically what is happening is it's just basically going way past the bending point and it's just causing a lot of pain. I'm having to take a lot of painkillers and the thing is I can't take my strong ones till I come home at which point the pain is that bad that it's just, it's on, an, it's like on another level kind of thing and then, uh, you know, it's like you have to wait for them to kick in and they don't do as much because you're not taking them as the pain is getting bad, you're taking it when it is bad. Anyway... I'm just glad that today, tomorrow is my last day, um, so, yeah. Yeah, so my test is tomorrow morning, nice and early, get out, gotta get up at like quarter past six to be able to get there in time, ugh, but it'll be worth it in the end, guys, I'm just gonna have to sleep all, like, weekend, basically. Um, I'm gonna get some sleep now, before Tom gets home, I don't know what time he finishes, but it's late. I'm really cold, I'm exhausted, I'm gonna cuddle up, put something on Netflix and just fall asleep. Easy peasy. <laughs> hey guys, so it's, um, I'm really sure the time is like 9 o'clock or something like that. <sighs> I'm so tired. I've literally been sleeping. Tom's not home yet. Um, he's probably stuck in traffic. I know his, um, he was finishing late anyway, but yeah, that, that's why he's basically not home. Um, yeah, I'm knackered. I'm gonna, I don't know how, I'm gonna struggle tomorrow, like, I'm, I wanted to study a bit more tonight, but I just don't have the energy, like, it is hitting me, and we have, I've still got another day, so, um, I'm gonna try to get some more sleep, oh my gosh, my head, <sighs> like, I'm in so much pain with everything, like, I don't want to complain, I'm sorry for complaining, but, like, I know it'll be worth it in the end, um, I'm gonna try to get some sleep. Uh, I love you guys so, so much. Uh, I'll see everyone tomorrow. I'm going to try and edit the vlog before I go to bed tonight. So hopefully yesterday's vlog will be up. But this vlog and tomorrow's vlog will be up tomorrow probably. Um, but anyway, love you guys so, so much. I'll see everybody tomorrow.